For sure, for sure. So definitely emphasis on cloud pen testing. You know, I've done, my company's done about 17 uh, large pen tests this year uh, in 2021, and every single one of them had a cloud component to it, every single one. And that's the first time that's happened uh, over a year to where everyone had cloud to it. And not only that, most of them uh, had more than 50% cloud involvement with it, right? So that's a trend that's happening. So you definitely want to make sure that you're 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 properly marrying your understanding and mastery of cloud technologies to your building up your pen test skills. Um, the other thing is the focus on segmentation testing. The reason I bring that up is because so I've always done a lot of segmentation testing, primarily for companies that we pen test in the financial. Uh, sector of the industry. And that's because if you are a company, for example, and you take credit cards as a form of payment, you're required to do segmentation testing at least once a year, which means we have to go into the environment, identify where credit card data lives, and make sure that you're properly segmenting the rest of the network from where that credit card data lives. And most companies that credit card data is, is in like islands all over the place. So you have to segment test all of those islands and make sure nothing can get in or out that's not supposed to. But the reason that's becoming more and more popular now, and I'm getting it getting asked to do that for customers that aren't uh, companies that, that are under PCI and have to worry about the credit card things, is the new focus on zero trust, right? So in order for you to say zero trust in an internal environment or a big environment with many micro internal environments, it's hard to say zero trust if you don't even know who your segmentation is or where things are that you should or should not be trusting. So I'm seeing an uptick in organization asking, organizations asking us to help them find out where those segmentation points are so that they can start to actually build a zero trust framework um, around those different micro environments in their big environment. And then third, uh, containers and APIs, this kind of ties to cloud a little bit, but uh, definitely a lot of the things that we're testing now are not real servers or not even virtual machines. They're micro machines, containers. Uh, we're testing a lot of APIs versus testing actual, um, you know, full-fledged applications now. Uh, I've done a, quite a bit of stuff this year with, uh, you know, with Lambda objects and Lambda functions you know, how that triggers things and makes things happen. And a lot of times the website that you're testing doesn't even exist until, for example, uh, an API triggers some function and makes that website exist. Uh, and it might exist different for me than it would for you, Jeff, because the API has decided that you need to see the website a certain way. So all of those complex mechanics and architectures that are happening with cloud and, and containers and APIs, we're having, we're seeing a lot of where we're having to test the security of that stuff. And that's something else that if you're coming into the industry or if you're already in it and you're trying to beef up your skills, you want to focus on that.